The Affordable Care Act, or Obamacare, it's the law of the land, and it's also a key piece of both presidential candidates' campaign pitches. But for very different reasons. Secretary Clinton wants to preserve Obamacare and build on it so that more Americans are covered by health insurance. She also wants to make the public option, which is funded through taxpayer dollars, possible. And Matt, Trump wants to make some big changes here. He wants to repeal Obamacare and replace it with health savings accounts. Now, he also wants to give communities block grants for their own Medicaid programs so they can design their own. And he has a policy for keeping the cost of insurance in check. He wants to allow people to buy it across state lines, fueling more competition. Well, Clinton says that we must go much farther than that. She is proposing to keep health care premiums affordable. She would want to make her Secretary of Health and Human Services ensure any unreasonable rate hikes are blocked. She also wants to put a cap on out-of-pocket prescription drug costs. Matt, the heroin crisis, it's not often talked about in presidential elections, but this year it's a hot topic on the campaign trail. Sure, and both candidates have plans for this. Clinton says that she would want to partner with states, have the states come up with their own plans on tackling this crisis, and then fund those states. She also wants to increase federal funding for in- and outpatient treatment. And Matt, Donald Trump paying a lot of attention as well. He says the U.S. also needs to invest in much more treatment and stop the flow of heroin at the border. Both candidates agree this is certainly a crisis that needs to be dealt with. And they're both willing to spend money on it. It's just how is what you, the voter, will have to decide what you like better. For Commitment 2016, I'm Matt Barcaro. And I'm Barbara Barr for News 8. Our commitment team has several more issues to tackle this week, including family leave and education. In the next half hour, News 8 looks into how Clinton and Trump each plan to fight terrorism at home and abroad.